With most Yorkies being small in size, it is sometimes hard to tell whether the Yorkie is too skinny or not. They will naturally be a smaller type of dog, even when they get a little heavy, so how are the Yorkie owners supposed to know when their dog is too skinny or when the Yorkie is just the right size for their breed? Yorkies will be considered too skinny if they are under 4 pounds. This may seem very small, but the average weight for most Yorkies will be between 4 to 7 pounds. Once the Yorkie gets under this weight limit, they are at an increased risk for many health problems and injuries. If your Yorkie gets too small, it may be time to talk to their vet. Before I move on with the video, I want to ask you a simple question. Do you want to train your dog for any basic commands like sit and stay? Do you want to stop any of the behavioral problems of your dog like pooping inside the house, biting, jumping, or barking? If your answer is yes, please grab the free dog training secrets guide in which I have disclosed the deepest dog training secrets that professional dog trainers don't want you to know about. These training secrets would help you have a well-behaved, super intelligent, smart and obedient dog without spending hours in training him or her. The secret training technique ebook is available for free only for a limited time. So go and grab it before it's too late. Link to the free ebook and training videos is in the description below. Is my Yorkie too skinny? Yorkies are pretty small to start with so it is sometimes hard to know whether your Yorkie is just small like they should be or if they are too skinny. Most Yorkies are going to fall somewhere between 4 to 7 pounds. While the teacup Yorkie is becoming popular and these dogs are often under the 4 pound limit, this is often not a safe option to work with. Yorkies who are under the 4 pounds are going to run into many health problems because of their small size. What is the average size of a Yorkie? Yorkies are going to stay pretty small for most of their lives. This can sometimes make it hard to tell if they are too much weight or too little. A Yorkie who is an adult will be somewhere between 7 to 8 inches tall when you measure them from the ground right up to the ridge between their shed blades. This can make any weight gain or weight loss appear very quickly on your Yorkie. Your Yorkie could lose a little bit of weight and appear to have lost too much. This will make it difficult for the Yorkie owner to know whether their dog is getting too skinny or not. What is the average weight of a Yorkie? You also need to consider what the average weight of the Yorkie should be. Since these Yorkies are going to be small to start with, you will not see them weigh all that much. Yorkies will often come in between 4 to 7 pounds, though it is not uncommon for purebred Yorkies to sometimes weigh a little bit more and be closer to 10 pounds. In a few cases, Yorkies can weigh a higher number closer to 15 pounds. This is not very common though unless there was another type of dog added to the genealogy at some point. Most Yorkies are going to tend towards the heavier side rather than being too skinny because they like to eat and get treats from their owners. It is possible that the weight of your Yorkie is going to fluctuate depending on their lifestyle, exercise, and nutrition. However, if you have an adult Yorkie who weighs less than 4 pounds, then this is a sign that a Yorkie is underweight. Any Yorkie who is less than this weight will be known as a teacup Yorkie. While these are a popular option for many dog owners to consider, they do have a higher risk of different health problems compared to other dogs too. How can I tell if my Yorkie is the right size? It is often hard to weigh a Yorkie on a scale. Our traditional ones at home are not able to handle this that well, your dog may not sit down very well either. You could take them to the vet who will have more precise measuring tools. But a physical assessment can work too. Some of the things that you can do during this inspection include Look down at the dog from behind them. You should notice that their waist curves in a bit as you move from the rib cage down to the waist. If the Yorkie is underweight, the curve inward will be sharp and small. You can also look at them from the side and look at the Yorkie's abdomen. If the dog is a healthy weight, you will notice their stomach goes upward from the rib cage. A Yorkie who is too skinny will have a stomach that appears sharply tucked upward from the ribs. Another way to check out the weight is to place your hands on the sides of the dog's body, right at the rib cage. You should be able to feel the ribs without seeing them. If you are able to see any of the ribs, then this is a sign that they do not weigh enough. If you can't feel the ribs, on the other hand, this means you have overfed the dog. If you find that the hair on the Yorkie makes this visual assessment hard, then you can use your hands to help you get a feel for some of the drastic physical signs that your dog is underweight and not feeling well. If you can feel the ribs, the vertebrae are prominent, or you notice the pelvic bone is jutting out, then this is a sign the dog does not weigh enough. Why should I worry about my Yorkie being skinny? 
When your Yorkie is underweight, this can be a sign that they are not getting enough food. When they do not receive the amount of food that they should, they will not receive enough nutrition to help them stay healthy and to grow properly. If you do think that your Yorkie is too skinny, then it may be time to consider a more nutrient-dense food with a few more calories to help. Yorkies who are too skinny are more prone to health conditions as well. Being underweight can be hard on the body and will make it hard for them to get nutrients, fight off infections, or stay healthy at all. While the teacup Yorkies are great to have in your home sometimes and can look cute, these are at a higher risk for being unhealthy and needing more visits to the vet's office. There is nothing wrong with a Yorkie being at the lower end of the weight limit that we talked about before. Some Yorkies are naturally smaller than others and this can be perfectly healthy as long as there are no other issues at play. The problem will come when the Yorkies get below that limit. Some are bred for this, but it can still be dangerous to the health of your Yorkie if they start to get too small. Do you want to have a well-behaved, obedient and calm pet dog without spending hours in training him? Check out the first link in the description and download the secret training technique guide absolutely free. It is available for free only for a limited period of time. Thanks for watching the video. Comment below if you liked the video. Please subscribe to the channel Little Paws Training if you are serious about training and grooming your dog. Also, join our Facebook group where you get all the solutions to your daily doggy problems.